Okay, here in this video we're going to look at some of these problems from our worksheet on um, the trig identities involving the double angles, half angles, and the likes, okay? Um, hopefully the, some of these were pretty straightforward, okay? Like the first one, okay? From, uh, we know that the cosine, we know what the cosine of, uh, of pi over 6 is, we know it's uh, root 3 over 2, we know that the cosine of pi over 3 is 1 half, so it says using the half angle identity for cosine, so the cosine half angle identity is, uh, cosine half angle is plus or minus the root of 1 plus the cosine of theta over 2, and of course, so if we want to find the cosine of pi over 6, from the cosine of pi over 3, we're going to use this identity. So sure enough, plus or minus the square root of uh, 1 plus uh, the uh, cosine of pi over 3 is inserted here as 1 half over 2. So that's um, 3 halves over 2 over 2, which is radical 3 fourths, which lo and behold is square root of 3 over two and because we're assuming we're in the first quadrant we're going to take that as positive so that's showing how that's illustrated similar for number two um double angle identity for for um for the sine okay the sine of two theta is you should know sine of two theta is two cosine theta sine theta uh, so if we're trying to find the sine of pi over 3 with the sine of pi over 6, of course we know the sine of pi over 3 is root 3 over 2. We know the sine of pi over 6 is 1 half. Okay, um, so here we go. And, and so um, if we use the identity to the cosine of um, pi over uh we need the cosine of pi over 6, which, of course, the cosine of pi over 6 is um, root 3 over 2 uh, times the um, sine of pi over 6, which is 1 half. And if we multiply these all out, got that half canceling out, we get the root 3 over 2, which we know is the sine of pi over 3. So that illustrates that that works. Okay. Um, Tangent, you could do the same way. Uh, appropriate translation here for sine of pi over two. This is this is uh, supposedly uh, we know that that is the case because of the translation. So, uh, but we're going to show that with the with the expansion formula for the sine, which is the what the sine of uh, a minus b is the sine of a. Uh, cosine of b plus the cosine of a sine of b. So, uh, so, so then the sine of uh, pi over 2 minus theta should equal the sine of pi over 2 times the cosine of theta plus the cosine of pi over 2 times the sine of theta. So sine of theta, pi over 2 is 1, so that just gives us the cosine of theta. Cosine of pi over 2 is 0, so that whole thing is plus 0. So obviously this goes to cosine just like we thought it would. Okay. All right, look at another one, and then we'll, uh, and then we'll uh, cut the, go to another video, okay? So the cosine thing would be the same thing. You're going to do the same thing here with the sine of 3 theta. I'll just get you started with that. That's going to be the sine of uh, 2 theta plus theta, uh, which, of course, is what? The sine of uh, 2 theta cosine of theta uh, plus the cosine of 2 theta times the sine of theta. And then, of course, You'll have to expand this out, which is uh, what to the sine of theta, cosine of theta, times the cosine of theta, 
plus the cosine squared, which uh, cosine of the two theta squared, which is cosine squared of theta minus sine squared of theta. Cosine squared of theta minus sine squared of theta times the uh, sine of theta. So if you uh, uh, expand this out, so you get 2 the sine theta cosine squared uh, plus, um, what did we get, the uh, sine of theta cosine squared. minus the sine cubed of theta. All right, so then looks like we got two sine cosine squared and another, so we got three sine cosine squared of theta minus the sine cubed of theta. Now I think with a appropriate substitution here, this cosine being renamed as one minus the sine squared of theta times uh, the times three sine. I think you'll see when that's expanded out, you'll end up getting that expression um, that we're called for right there. Okay, so that'll do it for. Uh, I'll let you wrap that up. Okay, so that'll do it for this one.